initially it was a bit difficult. We could you couldn't read the German names. But with time I got over the confusion and we could learn to go about on our own. Hello guys, my name is Martin Zikov. I'm Austrian. Boku University offers introductory courses, so you will get the theoretical background. You will have a lot of introductory lectures in the field of limnology. But nevertheless, you have uh, chances to do excursions. If not in the curriculum, you can always do an elective. So feel free to inform yourself. There are many options you can do. And anyhow, you need the ECTS credits later on. <laughs> my name is Damaris Kenywa. I'm from Kenya. This was my first time in Europe. I was pretty scared, of course, and uh, also excited because I've never been to the, I've never experienced winter before. I also was scared about this bit about people being racist, but nothing happened. My name is John Maura Karyuki. I come from Kenya. The IPGL office had organized a uh, pickup from the airport. Uh, my first days were a bit confused. <laughs> it was more of getting to know each other from different people around the world. The first month was quite hectic. Some of us in, uh, in the group were just in autopilot. So the second month things started coming down and now we settled very well after the second month. In the hostel there is a uh, a gym, so I used to go to the gym in my, uh, during my free time and again uh, I'll, I'll do a lot of walks with my friends. In terms of uh, the city, I like the city, it's beautiful. There are many sites to visit. I love that the city is so green and that there's so much fun you can have in town. And the Danube walking, uh, like uh, flowing through the town, it's like Wow, nature in the city. I was amazed that I could walk from the, uh, the train station to my dormitory at 3 o'clock in the morning and nothing happened to me, so Austria is pretty safe for me. And uh, what I like about Austria is the organized transport because you just need your Google Maps, know where you're going, check out the direction and super cool, you get there. Initially I had carried my own food from Kenya. So after about three weeks, the food was over. I had to get food from the supermarket where they sell international food. You could get food from our country, although a bit expensive, they still can get food from Kenya. Austrian food, mm. and the hot wine. Yeah, there's hot wine over Christmas, remember? For people coming to Austria the first time, go out experience the country. Austria is a beautiful country and don't be afraid of the cold. Just take a warm jacket and enjoy. So get your winter clothes and uh, warm stuff like warm jackets, the scarves, the gloves, the cups. You need them and you will use them because I don't expect you guys to be staying indoors. I liked that one time we went sledding down the hills so that was one of the best things. I've never done that before and I liked it. That was my favorite part in Austria. I like that I met a lot of friendly people, maybe, yeah. Because I'm also friendly, so you meet friendly people. <laughs> I just love it. <laughs> it's so hard to pick like the best best, but everything is super nice here. If you come to this program, you are lucky. Take the opportunity and grab it. Do your homework in time, make more time for fun. I had high expectations, but I was not disappointed. I, I did not talk about the beer. Should I say some words about the beer? <laughs> and the parting move. Parting, I'll say that slowly. Thank God, that later. <laughs> Welcome to Austria! Hey, <laughs> <to experts. laughs>